so guys it's quite unfortunate what nollywood is turning into like a lot of atrocities a lot of evil things are really going on in there like junior pope's death has opened the eyes of nigerians to know that there is something wrong in the nollywood like there is something going on in there and which nigeria government need to regulate nollywood it's good to have a competitors where you are doing your business where you are working because it gives you that strength to work harder to create new ideas but when it comes to envy jealousy you're thinking of ending someone's life in order for you to take his or her position that is no 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 my people you putting your hand where you are not supposed to put your hand sacrificing human being just for you to get power get fame that is unbelievable my people so in this video one of nigeria actress lazarus miria she's here to tell us her experience like what she saw what she went through while she was in nollywood as well as angela okore hmm. angela okore said that we should have patience that she is coming to expose it all every evil thing that is going on in the nollywood as well as in our music industry hmm. my people this one really shocked me let me just allow you guys to watch this particular video and then i'll come back and read that what uh, angelo kore said guys uh, so many things happen in this industry so many things happen in this this industry is very deep oh. i'm going to tell you guys my experience in as much as god is there to always protect us we should not put ourselves ourselves in the line if you look at my eyes you know i'll be crying like this whole thing just brought, brought, brought back so much memory I remember when I, I used to, um, after school, I went to stay in Inugu because I was just going to acting and all that. I know it's in my IC. I know it's in my IC. I, like, there was one time that I went for this. I, I don't want to call anybody's name. I went for this guy's job. If you see where this guy carries go to go shoot, if you see where this guy to go to, these people, they don't really care about um, this Asaba people directors they don't really care about people's lives so they don't care about the upcomers you go through so many things because you just want to make a living you just have a passion you're pursuing so we went to this very thick forest to shoot this guy literally creates scenes on set you're a spiritual person the people you came with are they spiritual are they as strong as you are and all that he literally creates scene on set sometimes he will just bring up one song we just bring out one kind of song and tell everybody to start singing before me before my very eyes guys people were fainting people were freaking fainting there was one that he told us to be seen one time because we were um the movie was about um uh, witnesses converting to witches and all that guy there was one who was telling us to say that we should be shouting daughters of the blood so moon. our leader will be shouting daughters of the blood moon then we will be responding i've forgotten the response if we're here we're here i'll be what I, I can't tell guy before my very eye this girl the next thing she torn she's torn and she fell on the floor immediately the guy told us that we should keep quiet nobody should say anything he now went to carry the he started doing incantation he was just he was talking i don't know what he was saying no but he was just talking he was spraying it on the girl spraying it on the girl then the girl stood the hip he now held her and carried her up another one was when when we in a circle um, uh, if they pursue passion and uh, only god then the help person because then we're very young we don't even know so much what's up what was that what, 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 I didn't even believe in all these things, Seth. But going to that set, I, I I just knew that things exist. So the other one, we were standing. All of us were standing. I don't know who we were reciting because he, he knows how to bring some kind of song in his head and he'll start singing. One of us, the girl was standing. The girl just fell straight. Like, she was. She fell straight with her head. She just fell straight. I started hearing talks. Who would have worked with him? previously the other girl said the last job she went to do with this guy that they took um um one of the girls were in the water they had to use fowl to run the girl's head and they were doing this immediately the girl dragged the fowl from the person and used her mouth to remove the fowl's head the other one they said the, the other girl said that the last shoot they went to do that they were in the river too that they were doing what they were doing in the river the next thing when she opened her eyes she was in the hotel room that they said she just closed her eye and she fell inside water 
guide you. It's not any, every job you accept, though. It's not every That was the last time. Do you know that man told me on that set? That director told me on that set. Me and two other guests, he was like, You guys will have to see you. People don't have to see you for this job. I'm not taking of any of you to see you because I was saying things. I was so scared. Like, how just want me to not. Like, you want me to pour my heart out and be accepting. I don't even know. You go for a job, you follow, I want kind of demon follow you and go back to your house. Is it that east? Eh? Ah, God. Is it coming to this Lagos? Say, eh? I never saw myself creating content. Though. I really wanted to be an actor. But coming to this Lagos, say, eh, was just the best thing I could do for myself. Because there was one set we went to. There was one other set we went to. The place they camped us. Every morning by 5 o'clock, the man would call us and come outside uh, in one of the hotel rooms and let's pray. This prayer is not normal prayer. Oh. It's not normal prayer. Like, uh, praying for the day to be successful and all that. He's just. I don't know what he's calling out demon. I mean, he's trying to to to. I don't even understand. The prayer is not even a normal prayer. Me, ha. I know I say a very well that them. Um, I love Christ, so, but I know they overdo it and know he do. The guy go the the prayer eh? He bless say won't fuck demon come out. I'm not capping, bro. Before my very eye, I'm not capping. One of the guys that I think was a still photo guy, the guy just, the guy just like, he just fought for ground. People stay holding him. This guy was so strong. He was using his leg to, to match everybody. The next thing he's asking, is that, um, say, you seen us? You, what, 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 Baba, see, we did not say for Nollywood, eh? eh? I, most of my friends, eh, that might see this post, eh, I just pray that they have the boldness to comment that we're on that set with me, to comment that I'm not lying. This is what happened. The guy said insulting us that we we seen us we prostitutes. The guy was saying so many things. Yeah, I did not see anything, no. But I think two, two other person said that someone blacked him passed through mirror before the guy fell. I did not see. My person they hold God hand though because you don't even know where you're going to. I see. See, I don't even see we don't want to go back that server because the evil things there, the things that that they will just call people. They don't even care about you. They might be they, they might be protected. They might have what they need to protect themselves. So they don't care. They will put you in a line where things will be happening to you. That's, that movie I did was the last job I did in Asaba, in Enugu, before I came to Lagos. For my eye, people, they faint. People go turn like this, for split the entire body. Lights, red, um, red head, what they call it, they, they box middle of night. We just said, see, 1 a.m. Very, if, you see, if you see the place we're shooting them, if we're going to the place in the morning, let's say you don't get money to buy food anything or you don't get your food but why you know go trouble because there's no way to buy things around that place you should know how thick that place is there's no way to buy things and you don't, don't care about upcomers in the east they don't care about you if they only bring food for um for the crew members and all that they don't care about you they feel like they're doing you a favor there's no only way people they need to look into a lot of things they do they need to look into a lot of things they do it's not that anybody i want to shoot to carry anybody and go to anywhere you don't even you don't even know where you're going to they just carry you and go to anywhere. And the funny thing is that once they give you a script, you're on set, you go enter location bus. You don't know where you're going. You can't even say you're not going. You don't even know where you're going to. You don't even know where you're going to. You carry somebody to somebody's village that you don't even know if they're accepting. You can't keep, keep, just finish your book. Because you're doing what kind of what nonsense movie you collect. It's not every job. If you're not sure of where you're going to, your mind will just carry you. No, just go. It hurts so bad when I see our young ladies, our young girls, you know, go through all this just because they want to showcase their own given talent. And those other on tops now use the opportunity to do whatever they want to do with them. Very, very unfortunate. And this kind of a thing needs to stop here in Nigeria. Let me read that what Angelo Kore said. Apparently, I would like to eat before talking so I can have enough stamina to talk. I am warming up. Whenever you see evil, speak out. Since the death of Junior Pope, I haven't been myself. I see a lot of fake people writing episodes. But when he was alive, they didn't do him right. Mad people bombastic elements with no pedigree because of role some of you on a by people inflict deadly diseases on innocent people before you know it then go just say the person don't buy even music industry is not exceptional if i start to talk tap feel no rich but i go talk and because i'm alive so the world will know i am coming my people hmm this is what uh, Angelo Kore said. She said that she's coming, that she's warming up, that we all need to hear it because 
it needs to be told. So that is it, my people. Please, if today is your first time, don't forget to share this video, subscribe, and also like this video. Yeah, I will see you guys in my next update. Thank you so much for watching, and goodbye for now.